Welcome into the 24-7 Sports Channel. I'm your host today, the 24-7 Sports Director of Scouting, Adam Finkelstein, for another episode of Commitment HQ. And today we've got Drew McKenna set to make his live announcement with us momentarily here, the four-star forward, one of the more versatile players in the country. Get a look at his profile there. A top 100 prospect in the national class of 2024, 22nd in his position, number one in his state. And as I said, a truly versatile mismatch problem. At six foot seven, he's got the strong body to operate inside, but he can also face up and take you off the dribble. An inside out force and a force to be reckoned with, especially on the offensive end of the floor. Drew has limited his finalists down to three schools, all in the Big East. You get a look at the candidates there. He's got Butler, Xavier, and Georgetown that he will be deciding between here today. So it is truly a battle in the Big East. So without further ado, we are going to bring Drew and his family live into today's broadcast. Drew, what's up? Welcome to the show. How you doing? I'm great, thanks. Congratulations. I know this is a big day for you and your family. But I want to ask you, what has this process been like for you? Because I know you've been a good player for a long time. You know, the, the process of developing your game, of getting recruited, of having to narrow it down. What's What have all these years been like for you? Uh, it's, been, it's, been, it's been a tough couple of years, you know. Uh, coming to high school, I wasn't really known too well. You know, I got a chance to go out. And after my, my sophomore year, my recruiting skyrocketed. So it's just been, ever since then, it's just been, it's been pretty crazy and just, just a blessing, so. All right, now before we give you an opportunity to make your big announcement, I always like to give players the chance to thank those who have helped them and, of course, introduce the people who are around them on their big day. So why don't you go ahead, thank whoever you have to thank, tell us who's sitting next to you, and then we'll get to the moment at hand. Uh, this is my mother. Uh, this is my dad right here. And my sister, she's not here, and even my little brother. But first and foremost, I'm going to thank God, thank my family. Then I want to thank uh, uh, I want to thank Linnell for giving me a chance to really shine, and Coach O'Donnell, Coach Francis, taking the opportunity on me when no one else did. So that really changed my life. And I want to thank my mom for always just being there for me and just helping me along the process with everything. I want to thank my father just being there through my ups and downs, countless hours in the gym, and just just starting from nothing, you know. So my father was there. He got my friend in the back. Like, he really, he always did for me. He always made sure I work hard, keep me straight, keep me humble. So I'm going to thank him for that. I'm going to thank all my teammates and just everyone that helped me get here and all the coaches that recruited me. All right. That is that is a very cool sentiment. I know everybody appreciates it. But now it is time for you to make your college announcements. So which of those three schools will you be attending? Uh, I'll be attending Georgetown University. <laughs> All right. and I will be classifying up to class 2023. Congrats. Graduating this year. So he's going to Georgetown right away, everybody. All right. Big news here on the 24 7 Sports Channel. Drew McKenna commits to Georgetown and reclassifies for the class of 2023, previously in the class of 2024. So, Drew, what was it about Georgetown? Uh, that made you want to go there and play for Ed Cooley? Uh, coach Ed Cooley, he's a really relatable coach, man. And just hearing his story, uh, it's kind of similar to mine. So, like, just seeing everything he went through to get to the point he's at, you know, I really believe in that. I really believe in the family aspect that he brings to Georgetown. And just just being being close to home, you know, a lot to me because my family's big. And being from the area, being from PG County, close to D.C., you know, it means a lot to be able to to uplift the area and bring Georgetown back. Well, and obviously that's going to be important for him to get local talent like yourself to, to stay at home and play for Georgetown. All right, now I've got to ask you about the decision to go to the class of 2023. What went into that choice? Uh, Just seeing, seeing this year, the way I was playing against top-level talent in the class of 2023, uh, it, just, it was out of I never thought I'd see it where I'll reclass up, but, you know, just just dominating at that level. And the coaches wanted me to come on, on the campus this year. So I talked over with my family. That was the best the best decision for me. So I didn't hesitate. 
Well, I'm sure your family is very excited. They're going to get the chance to watch you play your college basketball right in your backyard. Drew, first of all, congratulations. Second, thanks so much for doing this uh, here with us on the 24-7 Sports Channel. Tremendous uh, commitment for you, and we wish you all the best of luck next season. Thank you. All right, everybody. And that is Drew McKenna, who is committing to Georgetown, moving up to the class of 2023. We knew when Ed Cooley got to Georgetown, he was going to have to rebuild this roster and do it in a hurry. And make no mistake about it, Drew McKenna is the type of player that has historically thrived under Cooley. Cooley is a coach that has played a physical style, a half court, kind of grind it out type of game most years. And the power forward position, especially when you can find a versatile four man, again, that is a spot that has thrived under Cooley. And Drew McKenna is exactly that, a versatile four who has the size and strength to operate inside, but can also face up and play make off the dribble, creates all types of mismatch problems. And that should be a skill set that is well utilized in a Georgetown system that will look a lot like the Providence system of old. So if you're watching at home, please make sure to visit 247sports.com for more analysis and coverage. And as always, be sure to like and subscribe here on the 24-7 Sports Channel. We'll see you again real soon.